Well, the written word takes on a whole new meaning where you can actually reach out and touch your subject matter. Students in Catoosa County earned new respect for their local library thanks to a hands-on program with the Tennessee Aquarium. You can see for yourself the nights of what's right with our school. So we're actually going to talk specifically about oceans and how we can take care of them. We have what's called our summer reading program, which is geared for all ages, from our babies all the way up to our seniors. And our goal is to continue early literacy throughout the um, entire summer, because most kids do not read during the summer, as we know. So we want to encourage them to continue to read, um, build those skills so they don't lose anything. We provide um, activities, games, crafts, um, presenters today, um, all kinds of fun stuff to get them in here and continue reading. Do we know what these are? Yes. What are they? They're pieces of coral. Well, the kids bring us here today. It's very important for us through the summer to share with them a lot of our animals and a lot of the things we do in the summer. Um, outreach is very important so we can send out the message of what the conservation of the aquarium is and how important animals are to their lives and our lives. Can you guys see all these? <laughs> we can see them on the floor. Can you see? Okay, I'm going to pass them around a little bit. If you guys can see, these are serrated teeth. The shark teeth were very sharp. Yeah. And they had a bunch of rows. Good job. Good job, buddy. I like it touching the creatures. <laughs> I like that, too. It's been really exciting to see the different animals and things that they can touch and um, explore and gain a better understanding and uh, take care of the, the things around them. The most important part of this summer is the learning, just being part of what they do every year, all through the year, just keep it at it. You know, if we keep doing that throughout the summer, by the time they get back to school, it shouldn't be even a big deal. It should be just perfect for them to go back into school and continue their learning. These are the teeth that they use. Yep. Yeah. These, are the, these are around the back. Ow, these are, these ones are sharp. We hope that they come back to the library and realize that all the free services we offer, the resources that we have, and um, continue education, um, and it's free. It's the one thing that we have in our community that is free. Um, you can get a library card for free, or you can go for two years. Um, the biggest thing is we want the kids getting the books into their hands. That's our goal. A great idea there. If you know something positive that's happening in our schools, we'd love to hear about that. Just email us at news at wdf.com. You might see your idea on a future edition of What's Right With Our Schools.